a creative uh, producer, which means I oversee producing all of the shows here and all of the entertainment you see. Um, I also had a hand in choreography for the show. This is her passion, so yes. <laughs> um, you all got to see it. So we just wanted to give you a few minutes to ask her a little bit. is the flip from the holidays to this show? How much time did you guys have to redress and set everything up? I believe the team to build like the trampoline and everything was in on January 3rd. So three days. <laughs> <laughs> Some shows people just love so we got to bring them back you know. <laughs> this is brand new though to this park and this event. And I saw they were doing meet and greets afterwards. Does that happen for every show? Yes. And then um, in just a little bit, Lloyd will be out there meeting and greeting as well. He's got to finish his tea first. <laughs> it is just to add the uh, very immense water effects. <laughs> were you were you sat in the splash right zone? That was awesome. I loved it. Well, with the element of water, it's almost expected at this point, right? That we have some water effects. It's also nice to see snow machines out of December uh, yeah, time. Yeah, the, the snow and I, the temperatures right now might be a little closer to that right. northern atmosphere. So, yeah, so Dragon's Drum Beat, if you have been here for Ninjago Weekends past, we had Earth Beats. Um, so it's just a little bit of a revamped show from the past. Um, they've got brand new carts and drum equipment and it's really high energy and that is again like we bring the professionals in for that one. Nice. But it's a lot of fun if you haven't gone and seen it yet. Yeah. 